Good morning YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Today is Wednesday, I've got no idea what the date is, sometime in June, but it's uh, off to Border Wingding. Border Wingding uh, starts tomorrow, so we're going down today to help set up the site and what have you, so we're just about ready to go. Um, this morning it's flipping lovely and lovely and warm, red hot, like, I mean if this weather it would be lovely if this weather held out like it really would, like it would be, end up being like Alba. Alba winging was red hot. Uh, and this would be the same if this weather could hold out like this. But anyhow, let's uh, crack on get down the road. So it's a Swift 122 goes to Darlington. With the Honda Gold Ring 2021 GL 1800. In two. And Bodie's in the back. Bodie's being put poorly overnight. Like, Bodie's. He, every, every so often he gets these nights where he, he, he needs, he wants to be in and out, in and out, eating grass and that, because he's got an upset tummy. Like, and last night, I think it was about four or five times I was up and down with him, like, letting him out. So, I'm a little bit tired to say the least. But, uh, hey ho, let's crack on. See you further down the road. Uh, we're on Stair 68, um, dropping down into West Woodburn now, but uh, I'll put the camera back on for the view, like, uh, absolutely stunning scenery, like. Um, there'll be a bit of wind noise, because I've got both wind I've got both the front windows open, actually, like. Um, to let some air through. And Bodie's on the front seat, and he's harness, of course, like, and he's, uh, he appreciates the window being open, so he's getting a good blast of air, like, so. <laughs> Well, that's just, just dropping down into Westwood, then. Uh, past the bay horse on the left at the bottom here. Do a fantastic Sunday carberry if anybody fancies, uh, fancies a trip out up the year 68. Yeah, the beer horse on a Sunday. Excellent carving. There we go, on the left hand side. It's past the cenotaph, the memorial there. On the right hand side. The memorial has to sell it. No, no more. Whoop! Change gear then, bloody book. Bodie wasn't expecting it. He's right on the end of his tether there, like he's got his heel out the window, his nose out the window though. <laughs> Taking advantage of the bloody. That's it, that's it, son. Get back to him, we'll have to clip on that. What well, a new bloody wing passed me before that righteous moment just before I put the camera on a new wing uh, rider and pillion on like red and black one heading north past me before. Right we're gonna crack on. But we're just gonna go on to the A69 soon, because uh, the A68 splits at the 69. Goes we have to turn left onto the A69, go a couple of miles along the road, and then back right onto the A68. It's a break in the 68. In a quarter of a mile, exit left. Yeah, we go. Straight exit ahead. Exit left. Straight ahead, Corbridge, Corbin, Corbridge Roman Village. Beautiful little place if you haven't been, worth a visit. We have just stopped there in the lay by here. It's a great board, you can get up and have a pee, and I was bursting for a pee as well, like so. Whew. Quite a bit relieved now, having a wee. <laughs> I've changed the with the camera turned round, I put the microphones now connected to the sun visor, so 
it's not connected to the seat belt like it was before, so we'll see how that is. See if that's picking up my voice okay or not. Um, we're just heading up towards Tau Low now, actually. So, um, we'll be stopping for fuel because um, we've got the, the low fuel warning light come on. Like, there's still two bars of fuel in. Um, but we'll be stopping for fuel and uh, we'll be well topping up the gas because the station will stop at this. Uh, sells out the G as well, like so. If everything's okay and they've got what we need, well, we'll be filling up the diesel and filling up the LPG. Shifting cattle. <laughs> oh, the quad shifting like something there, like. It's pretty skilled, like. <laughs> That's pretty skilled, that, like. Definitely skilled now. <laughs> the speed he brought them across that road and in that other gear for that one. <laughs> what a bad it, It's a bad spot to be crossing the 68, that I've seen, mate. The brow of a hill. <laughs> I hate that one. But I'm sure they've done it millions of times. So they'll be well used to stopping. Stopping the traffic. Well, just filled up there, and it took £132 to fill the tank. £132. <laughs> hey! Flipping it, man. I filled the gas up with now. That took £5. Five £5.50 five, five or something. <laughs> filled the gas up. Uh, but the diesel, £132. It's 191 pence a litre here. Oh, well, he's trying to get on the seat there. Come on, end up. <laughs> he couldn't get on the seat, he slipped up there. Right. Hamster Lee Forest. Woohoo! <laughs> we're heading to the road to Darlington. Well, we're just arriving at Darlington Rummy Club. Let me see what time is it. <laughs> I don't know what the hell the time is. Like. Two minutes to twelve. So that's pretty good time, I suppose. Like. Pretty good timing. Which way we'll be going, like, but never mind. Come on, action!
She takes longer. And here we have a fine bunch of men erecting a tent. I'm not there. That's about a wing ding done. We're on my way home. Um, I'm a wee bit rough like. Uh, had a bit of a angina attack there and knocked us, <laughs> knocked it out of us a bit like so I'll be glad to get home. So there might be not much of the uh, homeward bound trip. Well that's just on the year 68 now so one road all the way home to the door. <laughs> oh, that's fair. Uh, another warm deer, I tell you. Cliff, I don't know. Oh. Been a great weekend, but well, well, since last, since Wednesday, yeah, a long weekend. Uh, great, but uh, flipping exhausted. <laughs> Can't wait to get home for a rest. <laughs> that's been great. Absolutely great. The ride out was great. So, all in all, I think it was a very successful winding. Uh, get home, have a few days at home, recuperate, <laughs> have a decent bath. <laughs> uh, I do a few jobs that need to, and Bodie's got to go and have his hair cut. Got to go to the groomers as well, so he'll be nice and fresh. Yeah, after he's been the crew, after he's been to get his hair cut down again. Uh, anyhow, we'll crack on up the road. We're up on the, um, bah, aye, the top end of the 68 now, so near and home, near and home. <laughs> Not many miles, but I just put the camera back on because the views. Fantastic. Beautiful, beautiful home in Northumberland. Woo! One of the big dipper roads, the A68. It's like a big dipper, it's up and down. Up and down. That's us dropping back down home now. This is uh, Kielda Reesdale, Kielda and Reesdale Forest, Vola Park, I suppose it's called. I'm flipping that now as well. I live here. <laughs> it's 
place to be in the trees again. See that like I think the the trees down at that dark ruby trunk bigger. They sat me out with a bunny the pollen again like look at that. <laughs> Few people suffer from it down down there like right? so it's uh, definitely uh, Different type of pollen than the <laughs> tomorrow I can work with your gear, that's for sure. But uh, it's just, just, just glory out there. The colours, the greens, and that. And a lovely day, beautiful. But it's great to be back here. Get sorted out, get things put away, get the bath filled, get in the tub. There's a couple of hollies there. Hazard reported ahead. Hazard? That's my use. <laughs> According to the map. Well, they've got lights. <laughs> oh, I know what that's for. It's for the bloody man over on the other side of the road. I remember it was there. Uh, Popped, popped out the bloody grid. There's a big metal grid there on the other side of the road, and when the wagons go across it, they flip it up, and then they get smashed. It's dangerous, like, because it's sticking up in the air. No, oh, they've relayed it, like. Oh, no, no, no I still miss them. <laughs> I wonder what the hell that was. Or 